So we have genes, different predispositions we inherit. Um, but then there are other things that turn those genes on or off, mm -hmm. um, depending on some things we can control and some we can't. Um, so I think that's fascinating. I've been doing a lot of reading about that. And you know, what can we do to right. control how, how our genes are expressed? So what are some things, you mentioned nutrition. So what are some things that nutrition can do um, in terms of our epigenetics? <clears throat> Methylation is, is a, it's something that is like a cascade. Mm -hmm. And it starts with, I don't know if you've heard of the MTHFR oh, yes. gene. There's another name for that, which we can't say. Yes. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm you aware. use your imagination, people. So what nutrition can do, if, in order for methylation to occur, you need methyl donors. And those are vitamins, minerals, and right. things that we need. And we can get them from our diets. We can get them from supplements. But with the MTHFR uh, gene that if one of those SNPs is, is not good, there there's folic acid, which is a fake folate that's put into a lot of foods, mm -hmm. some supplements, and that form can actually be toxic to someone with the MTHFR mm. gene. So they think they're the doing the right thing, and they're actually causing harm to absolutely. Their, their bodies. Absolutely. So um, getting your nutrition, getting your the, the methyl donors from your diet, and then supplementation as well. Um, is step one. And then eating clean and making sure that you're not ingesting a lot of toxins from your food, mm -hmm. which is a good argument for the, for the organic produce. However, you know, it's not important to eat completely organic. You can if you wish, but there's the Dirty Dozen Clean 15, which will kind of guide you as to which tend to be the most toxic. Yeah. And washing all of your produce, whether it's organic or not, is important. But even as far as just who you are when you show up to the table, how you eat, do you eat slowly, are you relaxed, can have an impact on digestion to the point where you're either, you're either absorbing and you're utilizing those nu nutrients from your mm -hmm. food or you're not. 